Alright guys, so this is, um, I'm just going to show you a little bit around my apartment today, quick tour. So this is the elevator here, but today I'm just going to take the stairs and walk it because I only live on the second floor. So yeah, so this is my apartment. I'm just going to do a quick tour around. Okay. This is like our entrance hall. I come in. This one is one of the my co-teachers' rooms, so I live with two other guys. So this one is one of his rooms, and the other one's down here. So this is quite a good-sized apartment, really. It's a very good size. So I'll start with the bathroom. So the bathroom we have nice toilet and. Bathtub, really small bathtub. I don't know anyone who could fit in that, but oh well. Shower and our water heater. And then down here we've got a B day, which is quite common here in all, all across European countries. You can use a B day. Um, something that's quite unique, like all across Italy, is like the toilet flush is like up there. And to flush it, you kind of have to press this. Um, yeah, so this is our bathroom. <coughs> One of my roommate's rooms. That's the other teacher at my school lives in there. Uh, in here. Random cupboard with a exercise bike in it. Uh, it's quite dark in here and there is, is there a light in there. Now, I don't know where the light is for this, but this is just a random little room with an exercise bike in it and an ironing board. So our kitchen's pretty cool. So this is like our, uh, just a little seating area, kind of tabled for breakfast and everything. Um, and that's my cupboard, my co-teacher's cupboard and my other co-teacher's cupboard is that one. Uh, so one of my other co-teachers, he was the first one to arrive so he got the biggest room in the apartment and he kind of called dibs on the good stuff, which is cool. Um, our fridge and freezer. Lots of cool stuff in here. So I've got this middle shelf there. Um, it's amazing how in Italy you can afford like really cheap. You can get like proper good fresh fruits, vegetables and like really good local produce. It's not expensive at all. Um, Oven, sorry, our sink, our oven here, just for cooking and everything. So this oven is like quite an old stock and a gas one, so we need to use like one of one of these things on it. Uh, in here, this is like a little utility room slash laundry room. Uh, so we kind of do the clothes and the laundry in here. I've got a little basil plant on top. And then once I finish that, I kind of put all of my clothes on this washing line here out to dry during the daytime so this is just the internal view from our courtyard so we'll leave that out there and coming back through uh, okay there's another sink in here I don't really know what this sink is all about uh, this mess is just for recycling so we just recycle like a lot of these cans and glass jars and that kind of thing so yeah like we've got another sink there but no one really kind of uses that uh, coming back through. This is my bedroom. So apparently my bedroom is the smallest one in the apartment, but it's still a very good sized room. Like, it's still very good sized. The only difference is that I've got a single bed, whereas the other guys have got double beds in their rooms. But it is still a very good sized room, so I've got like my desk kind of workstation going on there, computer and notes and everything like that. Uh, my, da my table lamp. Uh, bed is just a single bed, but the other two rooms do have double beds in them. But because I was the last teacher here, that I kind of like drew the short straw in that sense. But it's still very, very nice. Big wardrobe, two big wardrobes, sorry. 
and lots of cupboard space. So up here I've got all like spare bed sheets. This blanket, I tend to put this blanket because the door has like a translucent window thing on it. So like at night time, I'll kind of like put this blanket up against there to kind of cover up, just give myself a bit of extra privacy. So yeah, we've got some more bed sheets in here and uh, some more stuff down there as well. Extra blankets, uh, my clothes and my shirts in here. And this is more bedding, I assume, for when it gets colder during the winter time. We've got all this nice thick bedding here, like a floor rug. So we've got loads of wardrobe space. And all these coat hangers came with the apartment, which is really cool. Um, just some shelves in that corner over there. Uh, my window out here onto the street, so I've got a nice little street view from my window with a mosquito net just to keep the insects out because apparently they can get a lot of insects and bugs and things in Italy when it's summertime. So yeah, this is my room, shoes down there and everything. My suitcase, I still haven't really found anywhere to kind of put my suitcase yet, so I've just kind of kept it here for now. All right, continue on. Okay, so this is like our living room. So we've got like a nice dining table there. Very good sized, like very decent sized apartment. I'm surprised at how big it is when I came here. And it's for three of us, but we all have plenty of room. So nice dining table there to kind of eat and everything. Um, all these nice little like antique pots and everything like that. I don't really know like what they're about. This is our, just kind of our landlord's stuff on here. Uh, a couple of sofas, so we've got one sofa there, a little coffee table, another sofa there, so we've got two two sofas here. Uh, TV, now the TV only has one channel that has English on, so we kind of really don't watch that much television, but it's still kind of cool to have. Um, little wicker rocking chair thing out there. So our heating in this apartment, apparently it's centralized to the building, so the building owners actually turn on the heating at whatever designated time when it does start getting cold. So that's good. So apparently it is quite well insulated in the winter. Uh, outside onto the balcony, so let's have a look. Big balcony, really nice big balcony. Easily enough space to like put a couple of chairs or like a barbecue or something like you could put a barbecue there. Maybe like a little table and some chairs out here, but we've just not really put anything there yet. Uh, so yeah, really nice big balcony. South facing as well, so we get all the sunlight coming onto here. Uh, so this is just kind of the, the street on where we live. Just a little bit of the kind of the street view around. And we live literally one minute's walk away from the train station. Like, I can see the train station from here. We're so close to it, which is really good for kind of getting around, traveling and everything like that. So yeah, so this is my apartment. So uh, hope you enjoy. I'll speak to y'all later.